Blessed good morning. Welcome to Miss Tamari Daily Mood. I have a beautiful message for you, son of God, you daughter of God. Today, Daily Mood topic is they will right yes deliver you to kill you that's our mood topic for today so what i mean by this well beloved you see in life people who you trusted people who you love and care about will deliver you to the enemy in order for the enemy to take you out guys yes what i mean by this also well beloved you see in life the very people that you trust the very people that you put your trust in the very people right that you look up to right yes to be by your side and stand by your side as a friend as a companion right as a partner right as a business partner right as a colleague right as an employee right yes and they in turn will turn on you guys just like that and sell you out for little and nothing guys right yes and they will you know aside with the enemy guys and plan up right to k-i-l you guys what i mean by this well they did it to christ look at judas iscariot judas iscariot was so close to christ but yet still he betrayed christ indeed guys same so people who is very close to you those are the one that end up you know k-i-l-l you and destroy others that you know right so if you're that man or that woman watching me right now beloved right you can understand what i'm saying that it is facts that people that you know personally even in your own personal life right even what you heard of guys right yes that your own close friends own close partner right business partner right colleague right employee right end up turn on them guys right yes and plan evil right yes to destroy them guys right yes what i mean by this well you see in life guys what I understand from Judas and Jesus Christ story, guys, it's that, you know, what I realize in society, that it's always the people that you never expect to destroy you is the one that plan up with the enemy to destroy you guys, right? Yes, what I mean by this. Well, you see in Matthew 24 verse 9, guys, it says, right, then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted and shall kill you and ye shall be hated of all nation for my name's sake. So what the scripture is saying is saying that Christ was saying right here that, you know, you see in life, guys, people will not like you for whatever reason, because of the spirit that you have, because of who you are and because of things that you have and they don't. So they become jealous and envy and covetous towards you guys. And they will team up with the enemy guys to destroy you, to K-I-L-L you guys. And that's why, guys, you have to always, you know, keep your prayer life active and, you know, watch the friends that you keep, right? When you see certain um, certain gesture that they make and they say it's funny, you know, they think to themselves, oh, it's a funny, you know, laugh. It's a funny message. It's not a funny message, guys. They know exactly what they're doing and you can see the key factor, guys, right? In people, when they really mean you good from people who don't really mean you good, guys, you're going to know, your spirit is going to nudge you. Just like Christ, he know that, you know, Judas Iscariot was going to betray him. Likewise, guys, oftentimes you know your betrayer. Oftentimes you know your backstabber. Oftentimes you know the ones who is going to, right, yes, betray you guys, right, yes, the spirit always a nudge you. The spirit always a give you a hint, guys. Sometimes if we really and truly, yes, guys, if sometimes we really and truly listen to that, you know, nudge that keep on nudging us, we'll never go wrong, you know, guys, right? Yes, but this is how life is, guys. So at the end of the day, don't live your life in fear, but trust the Almighty and don't trust no man, no woman, guys, but put your trust in God, right? Yes, and let your hope be in God and read Matthew 24, verse 9. Meditate on that scripture and apply it in one's life. It's a good scripture to remind us that, you know, then shall they deliver you, right, to be afflicted and shall kill you and ye shall be hated of all the nation for my name's sake. So those persons who believe in Christ, right, they will be hated by others. Yes, they will be hated by others, guys, and they will end up 
you know, K-I-L-L, right? Those peace, people who love Christ indeed, you know, for, the, for, for, for you bearing the name of Christ and saying that you believe in Christ, saying that you believe in God, right? People want to take you out just like that, guys, because of who you believe in and who you are and who you belong to, guys. So that's a message for someone indeed. Continue to let your hope be in God and don't be deceived by others when they say a little gesture, a little funny talk. They make a little gesture, a little funny talk, and then they laugh it off. Guys, it's no joke. Take people for who they are today. Take people for what they say, guys, right? Yes, because whatever a person say, it's come from the heart, guys. All right, you know, come from the mind or the thoughts. It come from the heart. So that's a message for someone and a warning indeed. Have a blessed and a wonderful Wednesday. Walk good. Thank you.